Hello, my beautiful Pisces friends. How are you? Welcome back to Sacred Knowledge Tarot. I am so happy and thankful to each and every one of you for being here with me today. So thank you, everyone. I'm going to pull three cards out of my tarot deck to see what message Spirit has for you this month, Pisces. And at the end of this reading, I'm going to pull additional bonus cards, including an angel number for you. So stay tuned for that as well. All right, my friends, let's see what spirit would like you to know. Judgment. This is you letting go of all that no longer serves you and making way for brand new beginnings here, Pisces. All right, this is a focus this month for you. All right. Next, we are going, uh, we've got the strength card. It's going to take a lot of strength. It's going to take patience. But know that this card predicts victory and triumph, my friends. All right, next we are getting the star card. Look at all of these major arcana cards for you, Pisces. You are divinely being guided through spirit and the universe. Whatever vision you have, whatever dream you have, know that this is going to come true for you. Get prepared for this. Major change is about to happen in your lives here, Pisces. I feel that this month is going to be a very big month for you. This is going to be all about you letting go of the old and coming into this place of the brand new. This is a new version of yourself. I do feel here there is that wind of change coming through for you in your life. And what I'm feeling here is some of you are coming into this place where maybe your belief system has changed. Or there's some sort of information or a truth that was revealed to you that has now altered the way you're thinking. Okay, maybe you were a, a one way a little while ago and now your, your beliefs and your um, perception around a certain thing has changed in your life, which is really causing some havoc, right? Which is kind of putting you in a place where you're not sure about things. There's uncertainty. This is what I'm feeling here. It's now time to let go of that old belief system and accept that you are evolving and changing into this new version of yourself. And with that is going to come a new beginning, a set of new people, a set of new life experiences. And for others, I feel this is you letting go of things that no longer serve your higher purpose. So this is you coming to a place where you're recognizing some of the things that have to change in your life in order Order to for you to really step into that brand new chapter that is going to bring you to a place of success okay letting go of bad habits bad ways of eating negative thinking limiting beliefs whatever this is for you now this month is the time to actually start moving forward and leaving these things behind okay you have to let go of some of the energies that are holding you back those of you that have been experiencing stagnation or feel that your life isn't headed towards the place that you want to go maybe it's taken a left turn or a right turn whatever turn it has taken it's time for you to really steer back into position and this is where it's going to happen this because this is going to be the judgment in your life are you this month capable of making those changes in your life here pisces i feel that you are that you have the power within yourself it's going to require a lot of strength but know that you are going to be in a place of success here okay it's now time to let go of your power past especially those of you that have been hanging on to your past right our past is gone it doesn't exist anymore the only way that it can exist is if you give thought to it and keep that in your mind which in turn those feelings that whatever is tied to it now becomes our reality and we start living in the past with those emotions, that regret, that hurt, that resentment, whatever it is, that pain, those wounds. It's now time to release them. And for some of you Pisces, you may have not processed, processed some of the emotions that were tied to that past. Maybe you suppressed them. Now is the time to really process those emotions and let them go. Because... This is going to be the determining factor of your future here. And spirit guides in the universe really need you to let go of that energy because that energy is, is like a, a blockage. And when you have a blockage, you can't, it doesn't allow new energy to come through. So it's now time to release that heavy weight. And for some of you, it does feel heavy and it is affecting your health. Okay, there's so many different ailments that come from anxiety or stress. And, you know, if you're living in your past, you can't really move forward. And right now that breeze of change is in your life and some of you are feeling it because things are happening and you can't control them. And letting go of control and allowing yourself to flow with the energy that's coming through 
through and releasing some things to lighten you up, to flow with that energy is going to help you in a big way here, my friends. Okay, so know that the universe is working in your favor. Spirit guides are giving you signs. There's a lot that you, you can see and, and gain guidance from in your life, in your present moment. Okay, so now is the time to really start looking towards your future and getting over the things that maybe you have hung on to for a long time. All right, this is going to require a lot of strength. It's going to require patience. It's going to require some time and energy. And know that you have it in you. You are much stronger than you know here, Pisces. You can overcome anything that comes your way. I feel you have gained and built the strength through your life experience. So when you think about the past, rather than thinking of it on a negative note, that's if you're doing this, okay? I'm not saying that everyone is here, Pisces. I do feel for some of us, we do carry that weight of the past around. And when we do that, we can't, we can't, there's no room for more, like the new energy that's coming in. So it's going to take strength for some of you to really release some of the attachments that we have that have come from our past. Things that, that were said to us, narratives or stories that we even tell ourselves. It's now time to release all of that because we are coming into this new place and know that this is going to, going through this process of letting go is going to build you even stronger here, Pisces. And boy, oh boy, are you a powerhouse. You are rec you are someone to be reckoned with. I feel that you have the power within you. You are highly intuitive, Pisces. I feel out of all the zodiac sign, you are someone that is very tapped into intuition intuition and the spirit realm and no matter what it is that you do you are stronger than you know like you harness this power so tap into that power my friends and move forward knock down any kind of barriers that might be in your way right now in order to push through and get to that place that you belong okay I feel whatever this is in your life, I feel some of you may be struggling to um, find a positive space in your life. Maybe the world just seems so chaotic and so uncertain and so negative and dark um, that it's going to take strength to really clear that fog and to start seeing through some of the the gray areas to see the beautiful light because the world is beautiful my friends there's so much to be grateful for i feel that we are in a place where there's so many blessings but there's so many distractions that don't allow us to see those blessings and it takes a uh, certain type of strength in order to clear that cloud and see through and see what the world actually has to offer and see some of the signs that the universe brings to us. You know, my husband saw a deer the other day and I told him what that meant. And, you know, sometimes it means like not being hard on yourself, right? And just to remember like signs from the universe, whether you're seeing animals, birds, signs, numbers, maybe there's a child repeating something to you, right? There's something that I feel that spirit guides are trying trying to communicate with you to let you know that you are stronger than you know, my friends. And patience is key here as well because there's divine timing at hand. And some of us, this world is just impatient, I feel. Everything's rush, rush, ru rush all the time. We want that instant gratification. And, you know, a lot of us, the younger generation, I feel like have... Uh, some of us have forgotten or the younger generation doesn't even know the amount of work you have to actually put into um, gaining that result of our hard work and what that actually feels like when you worked hard to gain that. Right. So this is coming through here for you. You are divinely being guided. So any wish that you have, anything that you're dreaming about, I feel for some of you, you're getting dreams to write them down because there's messages coming through your dreams. For others, I feel there's this path that you're meant to walk down and you're divinely being guided through spirit guides. You're seeing all the signs and I feel that some of you are following them. And truly, I, I, I believe that whatever it is that you're trying to manifest into your life, whatever it is that you're wishing for or dreaming about is gonna, going to come into fruition, but it's going to come as a seed. But I feel spirit guides are leading to you towards that seed. 
seed. And once you receive that seed, it's going to be up to you to plant that and grow it. It's going to take a lot of hard work and energy and effort on your part, but I feel that you are someone that is going to be capable of taking that dream, that star, whatever this is for you here at Pisces, and grow with it and come to this place where you are ultimately successful and living this beautiful, abundant life that you've been dreaming of. Know that spirit guides are guiding you towards that. And this is the month for you to really make any kind of changes that you need to in order to walk down this path that spirit guides are leading you towards. I feel for some of you, maybe you're feeling this gut feeling deep down inside that things do have to change in your life. Uh, maybe there's something that you're working on that may need adjustments. And remember, these paths that we're walking down, um, this could be anything that you're doing in your life. Everybody's living a different life experience. So remember, this is going to be different for everyone as I'm reading uh, these cards to you here. But we're all walking down this path and it leads us all in our different direction. I feel sometimes we're thrown off our path because of some of the distractions that are around us right remember we live in a chaotic world there's chaos everywhere and it's up to us to listen to the signs from the universe in order to find our way out of that place and this is what i'm feeling very strongly is happening for you pisces is that you are being led by spirit and the signs are so obvious and clear but some of us are so uh intertwined with our past and some of the regrets and failures and some of the things that have happened to us where we're allowing it to define us and fog our vision right where we're not able to see this so it's now time to release these energies so you can see some of these signs that are coming in from the universe that are leading you towards your ultimate goal here okay know that all your wishes are going to come true here pisces okay so i'm now going to pull two bonus cards for you these are going to have initials they may have some significance to you they come along with a message here so let's see what we get here for you pisces all right, so we are starting here with O for order. Some of your lives need order. There's too much chaos and we need order in that chaos, even if it's just a little bit to see our way through. Okay, so let me read this to you here. Peace amid chaos. Okay, so clear clutter, all under control. This means even in your life, where you're, you work the most, where you spend the most time to clear that clutter, clear that chaos, gain that clarity in all areas of your life, in your material world as well. Okay, so this is a strong message coming through. Maybe you know somebody that has an O in their name or there's something in your life where O is of significance. I'm now going to pull one more card and then I'll pull an angel number for you. S for spirit. Look at this. I do feel, Pisces, that spirit guides are really trying to connect with you and they're sending tons of different signs. Some of you are seeing them and some of you might not be. And if you're wondering why, it's probably because there needs to be a release that has to happen to clear that vision. Okay, so divinely guided, higher power is at hand, help from beyond. Ask your spirit guides for help here, Pisces. Okay, they're ready, they're waiting to help. So especially those of you that aren't seeing the signs, look around your life to see where there needs to be a clearing, right? And you'll start seeing the signs, all right? So that is your message through these cards. Maybe you know somebody that has an S in their name. And there's some significance there. So let me pull an angel number. Number eight, I am successful. Look at that, Pisces. Yes, you are successful. Let me read this card to you here. Your talent for setting and reaching goals is like no other. You are self-sufficient and capable of achieving your ambitions. All right. Representing the ebb and flow, the infinite loop of creation. Look at that. Flow with the energy. Flow with that breeze of change. Let go of things that are weighing you down and not letting you move. All right. You have to get into motion this month. All right. So that is your reading, my friends. I hope it resonates. If it does, please comment below. Hit that like button. If you're brand new to my channel and you're enjoying my content, please consider subscribing. Other than that, I wanted to wish you all a beautiful day and thank you so much for watching.